Hello children, good morning everyone. I hope every one of you are very happy and cute as always, isn't it? Fine kids, today Miss is going to teach you a new topic in EVS. It is about animals. Wait, about animals, you have learned it already, isn't it? Yes, today Miss is going to explain the other details about animals. Animals, okay? Fine. What have you learnt in the previous classes about animals, children? First, it is about wild animals. The animals that are found in forests. Examples are lion, tiger, giraffe. Yes? The second one, it is about domestic animals. Animals that are kept in homes or on farms. There are two types in it, pet animals and farm animals. Pet animals that are kept in homes, farm animals that are kept on farms. Examples are dogs, cats, horses, cattle, sheep, isn't it? Yes, these are domestic animals in common. The last part which we saw is about birds. Yes, birds are the flying creatures. Birds are also animals that have feathers and wings. Wings are the parts which helps the birds to fly. Examples are parrot, eagle and pigeon. These are the examples of birds. Till that, must have completed it. Yes? Today, we are going to learn more about animals. The first, Miss is going to explain is about birds. We have seen birds which can fly. Isn't it? Now, Miss is going to tell you the birds which do not fly. Some of the birds, they cannot fly also children. Even they have wings and feathers but they cannot fly. Some of the examples are ostrich and emu. These two birds cannot fly. Can you see? This is an ostrich. Yes, this is a bird which do not fly. And the other example is emu. Okay? So remember kids, there are few birds which cannot fly. And there are few other birds which can swim in the water. Do you know those birds? Let me tell you children, the birds which can swim in the water are duck and swan. Yes, can you see here? The more of ducks, can you see it? It is so beautiful, isn't it? Yes, so remember children, ducks are the birds that can swim in the water. The other example is swan. Swan is also a bird that can swim in water. So children, today what have we seen? The birds which do not fly. What are the examples? It is ostrich and emu. Yes, the next topic, birds that can swim in the water. What are the examples Miss told you? They are duck and swan. So now let us play a small game children. I hope you people will like that. Yes, ready? Okay, now Miss will be showing you three pictures and you are going to find the odd one out. Odd one meaning the one picture which is not related to other two pictures. Ready to do that? Yes, here are the three pictures. Parrot, eagle, ostrich. Can you see this? Parrot, eagle, ostrich. Now, in these three pictures, you have to find the different one. Wait, all these three are birds. How come it is different? Do you have any idea? Can you guess? The answer is 
Ostrich. Yes. Why? Do you know why children? Because ostrich is the only bird here which cannot fly. The other two birds can fly. That's the reason. So the answer is ostrich. Yes, that's right again. Fine. I hope you have understood about birds so far. Now, shall we go on to the next topic? Yes, it is about insects. I-N-S-E-C-T-S Insects. Do you know what are they? Insects are the small animals that have six legs. Most of the insects will be having six legs children. But few insects they'll be having eight legs also. And even they have wings that helps them fly. Some of the examples are butterfly, grasshopper, mosquito, cockroach and housefly. These are the few examples of insects. Wow! Can you see those beautiful butterflies? Yes, these are the examples of insects children. Can you see how beautiful they are? Shall we touch them? Yes, can you see a butterfly is sitting on my hand? See how beautiful it is, isn't it? Yes, these are the details about insects children. Insects are small animals that have six or eight legs. Even they have wings that help them fly. Examples are butterfly, housefly, grasshopper, mosquito. So now, shall we play a small game again? Miss will be showing you the three pictures and try to find the odd one out. Ready now? Yes, here are the three pictures again. Housefly, lion, tiger. Housefly, lion, tiger. Now find out which is the odd one here. Answer is housefly. That is right because housefly is an insect where lion and tiger are the animals that is wild animals. That's right. So are you all clear about insects now children? Fine. So kids I hope till now you are clear with what Miss have taught. First, I told you about the birds that do not fly. Second, birds that can swim in the water. Third, it is about insects. Now, we are going to learn about the animals. Where do they live? Do you know where they live? Animals are found in forest. I told you, most of the animals, they are found in forest. Even in forest, they live in different places, children. First, tell me human beings, meaning people like us, where do we all live? Are we all always inside the sea? Or climbing on the trees, jumping over the trees? No, we live in our houses on the land, isn't it? Yes. Our houses are on the land. Likewise, there are some animals that live on the land, some animals in water and some live in both water and on land. Shall we see what are the animals? Yes, the first is animals that live on land. That is, in most of the forest we could see them. Some of the examples for the animals that live on land are lion, tiger, camel, goat, cat, dog. All these animals that live on the land children. Now here can you see a camel is standing here. A camel is an animal that lives on the land. Here, can you see a goat here? 
Yes, goat is another animal that also lives on the land. There are even more of other animals that will always live on the land. They will get the food and water from the land children. They move from one place to the other place on land to get the food and water and to live. Next, it is about the animals that live in water. Do you know what are the animals that live in water? Do you have any idea what are they? Which animal lives in water? The first answer which comes to our mind is fish. Isn't it? Can you see the beautiful fishes in here? They are of different size and color. Can you see how beautiful they are? Yes, there are other kinds of fishes also children. They are the shark, dolphin and whale. These are also one of the kinds of fishes that live in water. And the other animals that live in water are octopus, prawn, seahorse. You know them? They are so beautiful under the sea. Yes? Wow! Can you see this? Now it is like we are inside the water. Can you see everything? Yes! Here are the fishes moving. There is an octopus. Here is a shark. Can you see all these sea animals? It looks so beautiful, isn't it? Yes, this is the world under the sea, children. There are so many animals under the sea. They are living in the water and they get the food which they need to live from the water. As how we live on the land, how we get our food which we need on the land surface, the animals inside the water also get the same here. Can you see? There are few plants in here. Yes, it is more similar to the life on land. Next, let us learn about the animals that live on trees. Which animal lives on trees? Do you know them? The animal that lives on trees is monkeys. Yes, that's right. See, here is a monkey sitting over here. He is quietly sitting children. Let us not disturb him. Monkey is an example of animals that live on trees. Monkeys are always jumping from one tree to the other, isn't it? Yes, so till now we have seen about the animals that live on land, in water and on trees. Now we are going to learn about the animals that live both on land and in water. Shall we see the animals now? The animals that live on both land and water are frog and crocodile. These are the two animals that live on both land and water. Children, can you see them? There are two crocodiles in here. The other example I told you is frog. Can you see a frog here? Yes, frog is also another example children. Now, I hope you are clear about the animals and where do they live. Animals, they live on land, in water, on trees and some animals on both land and in water. These are the places where the animals live. Now, shall we try again here? Miss will be showing you few pictures of the animals. Try to find the places where they live. For example, if I am showing the fish picture, where do fish live? In water. Like that, you have to guess the answers. Ready now? Now, let me show you the pictures of the places, children. It is on land, in water, on trees. Both land and water. Can you see the four pictures here? Now I will be showing you the picture of the animals and try.
try to match the animals with the places where they live. Ready? Yes. So the first picture here is it is a shark. Shark. Where does it live? Yes, the shark, it lives in water. That's right. Now, can you see the shark inside water? Yes. Now, the second picture. What is that? It is a angry lion. Can you see him? Yes. It does. Lion live, children. Lion lives on land. That's right. Can you see the lion walking on the land? Yes. Now the third picture. Who is it climbing over there? Can you see who is playing? Yes, it is a monkey. And it does. Monkey live. Monkey lives on trees. Yes, that's right. Can you see him playing on the trees? Yes, the fourth picture. Who is it here? Wow, it is a crocodile. He is so angry, isn't it? Now, let us send him back to home, children. It does. A crocodile live. It will be both on land and water. Let us send him back to his home. Can you see? He is quietly walking in his home. Let us not disturb him, children. Okay, so now these are the things about animals and where do they live. I hope you people are clear about that. Okay, children, now Miss is going to ask you a few questions from the topics which we have learned so far. Ready? I will give you a question with four options. From that, try to find the correct answer. Okay now? The first question is, which bird cannot fly? Which bird cannot fly? Eagle, pigeon, emu, crow. Eagle, pigeon, emu, crow. Tell me, which bird cannot fly in this? The answer is emu. That is right. Emu is a bird that cannot fly. Now, the second question. Which animal lives only in water? Goat, fish, sparrow, cow. Which animal lives only in water? Which animal lives only in water? The answer is fish. That's right. Fish is the animal that lives only in water. Now, the third question. Which of the following is an insect here? Which of the following is an insect? Hen, butterfly, bear, elephant. Hen, butterfly, Bear, elephant. Which is an insect? Yes, butterfly is an insect. Butterfly is the correct answer. Now, the fourth question. Which animal lives on both land and in water? Which animal lives on both land and in water? Options are crocodile, Sparrow, monkey, lion. Crocodile, sparrow, monkey, lion. Which animal lives on both land and water? The answer is crocodile. Yes, crocodile is the animal that lives on both land and in water. That's right children. 
children now let us do another activity miss will tell you about the animals and try to find the answers whether it is correct or wrong if the answer if the sentence which miss is telling is correct you should say true if it is wrong you must say false ready now yes the first question a butterfly is an insect a butterfly is an insect a butterfly is it an insect yes a butterfly is an insect so the answer is true now the second question a grasshopper has nine legs see here a grasshopper it has nine legs is it correct i told you insects will have only six or eight legs right so here they have said grasshopper has nine legs grasshopper is an insect so the answer is wrong it is false okay now the third question monkeys live on trees monkeys live on trees is it right monkeys do they live on trees yes so the answer is true monkeys live on trees that's right now the fourth question an ostrich can fly an ostrich can fly is the statement right no an ostrich cannot fly so the answer is false yes well then children you have done it so well now i think you are clear about the animals where do they live and the types of animals shall we just recall everything now okay the first which we saw for today is the birds which cannot fly examples are ostrich and emu next birds that can swim examples duck and swan next it is about insects insects are small animals with six or eight legs they have wings to fly yes the examples are butterfly grasshopper house fly cockroach we saw about where do animals live there are four types which we saw first animals that live on land examples are the lion tiger camel giraffe all these animals also there are more animals that live on land children next the animals that live in water can you see it yes the animals that live in water fish octopus shark whale sea horse yes these are the animals that live in water next the animals that live on trees which animal lives on trees it is the monkey monkey lives on trees next the fourth one the animal that lives on both land and in water examples crocodile and frog these animals live on both land and in water children iniki nama paatha topics enna na first birds that do not fly sila birds get a wings feathers randomly irko but they cannot fly and the birds ala parakka mudiyadhu examples ostrich emu in the rendu birds aliyum parakka mudiyadhu next birds that can swim sila birds ala thannila swim panna mudiyum example duck 
swan next insects insects na enna adhu or kind of animals na but very small animals insects ku six illa na eight legs irukum even insects ku wings irukum children sila insects ala parakavum mudiyum examples butterflies house fly grasshopper mosquito cockroach inga paarenga oru cockroach dance aaditirukku cockroach or insect or example after that animals where do they live animals enga la vaalum first animals on land land la vaalra animals enna lion tiger giraffe camel horse cat dog hen idu ellame animals on land idu ellame land la vaalra animals second animals in water tanni la ka animals enna fish octopus sea horse shark whale idu ellame tanni la ka animals eppome tanni liye da irukum the third animals that live on trees eppome marathile vaalra animal edhu it is monkey monkeys eppome marathile da irukum the last one is animals that live on both land and in water land and water rendu thilume irk animals edhu crocodile and frog crocodile frog in the rendu animal me tanniliyo irkum tareliyo irkum that's it for today children i guess you people have known a lot about animals right fine enjoy with all the details stay happy and cute always thank you